Peter's Well Bray. Hmm. Uh, hello! Hello, hello, hello! That bit there, it looks like you can walk through it, but you can't, it gets rough. Really rough. I don't know how to get out of here. How do you get out to... Uh, how do you get out to the main road? Uh, I think that might be a pass up there. I've done it before, but I can't remember how. Uh, is that a wee pass? Is it? How on earth does one get to the main road? over here. Oh. Maybe there's not a way out in the main road. I can hear it. That's a carry your road so you think oh I hate these things see these things I hate them and this one cube I think it's over here see that sign up there <sighs> what does that sign say Gringate Gardens Act. Uh, I don't know where we are. Uh, might be up here somewhere. Uh, might be. <laughs> There's a windy stun. Oh, here's a toilet. There's a toilet up here. Yay! I can hear it. I can hear it. Oh, it's up here. It's up here. Heart wind. Why would you have a toilet outside your house? Oh, well, they must be working on it. Renovation. Must be what that is. And here we are. Almost walked on the grass. I'm fucking miles away from where I thought I was going to be. Cowie Road. That's Cowie. Uh, but you can certainly walk down this bit. No, sorry about the teeth. I'm 57. Semi-retarded. I'm semi-retarded. So I don't have... I, I only work certain days. In case it bothers any viewers out there. Of course, I'm only going on about... 
very small minority of negative comments, aren't they? <laughs> Green Yards Garden Centre is in there and behind the, the bus station. Don't have time to go on the roundabout. Uh, I don't have time. Cheeky. It's not your land. You can use it. You don't own it. That's the thing about boundaries, isn't it? What's the point of having a boundary, really? So there you go, that's all I've looking around about. Uh, I'd like to go in there, but... Well, could I suppose, but... Go in and take some pictures. I don't have time. I don't have time today. Uh, I don't have time! I'm busy today. This walk is longer than I thought. So, I'm thinking about doing the walk in two halves. Uh, it's probably easier for uploading than much of it as well. Technically, you would think no, but uh, what happens when the, it's when the, the video stops uploading. Uh, uh, it can crash. It's a weird thing that happens to it. Uh, it's um, Beaches Logistics Group. Now, get in here. I've got a bag. I have been thinking about getting a, grow, a GoPro, that would be a good idea. And it would be easier for... Um, easier for... Ooh. Easier. Whoa, Triumph TR6 or TR5A. Eh? That's a pity, I missed that. Could have got it from both angles. Why is it getting so busy? Wow, young lassie in a fancy Ford. Get old racer. It's a good old racer. I suppose I'm more into trucks now than ever was. Maybe. Maybe it's just as easier to see them. Maybe that's why. Is it easier to see trucks? I don't know. Yes, it is. I'd like to have filmed that Triumph TR5A. Well, I did film it, I just got the back of it. If I had a gimbal, things would be a lot smoother. And it's there. No, it's not. I still just going to the council, but... Well, they must subcontract to the council. And there's a low, a low loader type thing. I hope you're keeping an eye where you're walking. That's quite slightly breezy.
This is an exciting walk. We're walking at Station Road. Well, then I'm going to ski off round about, of course. I was arguing with a guy this morning and he wasn't happy because he said that I was an artist so I shouldn't I don't know anything about climate change and I should leave it to scientists. What I really meaning was I believe the scientists that I've been told to believe. Pedestrian crossing, 150 yards. And um, I said to him, because he was going, oh, I don't have any empathy for people in Pakistan. And I says, look, building floodplains. They're building houses on floodplains in the UK. Are you going to tell me that when they flood, you're going to attribute that to climate change? Oh. And, I, and I says, the problem you've got is you haven't thought about it deeply enough. Or not, you haven't thought about the topic. It's not that there isn't climate change. Of course there's climate change. It's, there's no climate emergency, is what we're saying. Right? There's no climate emergency. It's man-made media trollop shite. So, that's what I was saying. And uh, he got started getting really angry. Uh, So that's basically, I'm not saying there isn't climate change, I'm saying there's no climate emergency. So I, so I blamed it, I, I blamed it on the internet, and this thick bastard made out that I was thick. He thought I meant the internet caused it, as in literally caused climate change. I thought, moron. Absolutely fucking moron he is. I didn't mean that, I meant the internet, the, the climate emergency, media, and people that own their media companies have used the internet to spread the message. Ugh. I, you know, it's like sometimes, I, why am I dealing with such dumb bastards? And the reason is, well, just ignore them. Ugh. Don't deal with them. So, I think what we'll do, fucking hell, is I'm going to do this video in two parts. So I'm going to end it now. I'm going to start another part. Alright. So thanks for watching. Bye.